Yes! Oh my god, you can finally enchant it, guys! Oh my god! <laughs> hey guys, Mex here, and today we are back with a brand new video on Hypixel Skyblock. Hopefully you guys are all having an amazing day. And as you can tell by the title guys, today we are going to be getting our hands on the second best sword in the game, which is called the Leaping Sword. Guys, this sword is actually super duper insane. And today guys, I'm going to be telling you how I actually got my hands on this sword, how I'm going to make it, and how I got the money for this sword. So guys, Bear with me, I will be actually showing you all my strats on how you guys can get yourself the Leaping Sword in pretty much like 3 days I think. Like it hasn't taken me really too long but it honestly depends on how much you grind. So if you guys are hyped for this video, make sure you go down below, smash the like button and also make sure to subscribe because this is actually the first of many videos which I'm going to be doing just like this one. So hopefully you guys are prepared for some really cool videos in the future future but without further ado guys we are actually gonna get into this and right now i am going to be starting on how i got all this money so a lot of you guys are probably wondering max how did you actually get 4.4 mil and honestly it was a grind let's go over to my island and i want to show you guys what i currently have set up so over here if you guys can't see, I have a 160 by 160 pumpkin farm and my pumpkin farm is actually two layers. As you can all see, this isn't really the best setup for pumpkins and I know there's better setups out there. So, you know, I'll probably make an updated setup video for pumpkins if you guys are wondering how to do that. But um, also, as you can see, if I F5 right now, I have two layers of pumpkins and I have been grinding this so much when you're grinding pumpkins you're making a lot of money and a lot of progression but um yeah right now I am actually going to be spending around 2.9 ish mil on spider eyes but before we do that if I go over to my collection and we go over to spider eyes as you can see I currently have 85 spiders killed and four enchanted spider eyes uh, for the recipe, we actually need to kill around 605 more spiders. We are currently in need of actually getting spider eyes. So we're going to make our way over here to the spider's den. We actually need to kill a ton of these spiders. I don't know how long it will take. So uh, yeah, we're just going to quickly destroy all these spiders. As you guys can see, I do have looting on this. So it's actually going to come pretty handy. Let's go over to this higher area so we can kill a lot more spiders. Oh my god, it's actually kind of hard to get spider eyes. We have finally unlocked enchanted spider eyes and as you can all see, boom, there we go. We had to kill around 600 spiders to get us unlocked and shout out to Yummy T. He actually gave us three cave spider minions to help us out. It is finally time to actually start buying the spider eyes. Alright, so guys, we're going to go over here to um, the alchemist and we are going to be buying spider eyes. So if you guys don't already know, um, you can buy spider eyes from the alchemist for 12 coins each. One stack of spider eyes is 768 coins and it is going to take me around 2.9-ish mil. Uh, basically 3 mil to buy all the spider eyes which I need to uh, make this leaping sword so um, I will be buying a lot of spider eyes and yeah guys I'll be back once we are done so we are finally back from buying a bunch of spider eyes and what we had to do is craft them in to enchant the spider eyes and the reason for that is if we go over here to collection we go over here to combat and then spider eye as you guys can see we do need enchanted spider eyes and if you guys can do the mass we need 24 enchanted spider eyes i am super excited for this sword guys honestly this man's a legend all right so we finished trading him up the mushrooms and now we need to trade him up the spider eyes guys this is honestly an insane amount of spider eyes i don't even think i can trade them all of it at once so uh yeah dude i'm very excited for this sword i imagine we're going to be doing a lot of damage for once in my life dude i've had the ember rod for a while now 
and that hasn't really done too much damage oh my god guys it's the moment of truth let's trade him up i think he's finished crafting it oh my god guys this man over here is a legend okay shout out to this man right here yummy tea okay oh my god yo thank you so much dude oh my yo he is actually a legend guys like i can't believe i not have the leaping sword <laughs> i don't feel like a noob anymore that's crazy let's actually go over to my island and we are going to be checking out this sword so as you can all see we have the leaping sword now we have plus 150 damage for the strength we have plus 100 and for the crit damage we have plus 25 percent and i honestly feel like we can make that a lot better with reforges so i think right now the main thing which we're gonna do for this sword is reforging it and then i'm gonna go enchant it so uh yeah that's actually gonna be pretty cool um let's honestly see what reforge we can get on this guys i don't know how much money i'm gonna be spending on getting a good reforge for this sword oh we got legendary oh wow and i didn't even think i would get it <laughs> that's that's actually amazing dude i can't believe i got it like that quickly guys we now have a legendary leaping sword i have been grinding for around six hours now trying to get a bunch of titanic xp bots together so then i can enchant my leaping sword the amount of XP levels I needed was around 562 levels. Uh, if I quickly bring out my sword with the enchant, let me quickly show you over here, guys. Let's put it in, and as you can see, it's 562 levels. I am actually going to throw this. Oh my god, yes. 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 Oh my god, you can finally enchant it, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> Yo, I actually want to go test this out now. Like, I am super hyped. Like, I'm literally hyped, dude. Alright, so, you know, hopefully, maybe one day they can, like, get a skin for this. Like, that would be pretty cool. Because it looks really similar to the Rogue Sword. But, um, yeah, we have Legendary Reforge on it so far. So, as you guys can see, I'll have to change my GY scale. But, pretty much, um, as you can see, this is my sword, guys. Um, I do have... Uh, plus 150 damage plus 110 strength uh, My crit chance is 7% my crit damage is plus 82% uh, My attack speed is 10% and my intelligence is 18 and as you guys can see I have all of the enchants like impaling lot critical cleave looting and the slayer all of these wonderful enchants which you need for a god sword so uh, yeah, I'm very excited also guys the item ability leap okay it says here leap into the air and deal 118 base magic damage to nearby enemies upon landing on the ground damaged enemies will also be frozen for one second so i think what i'm gonna do right now is go over um to where's my grappling hook at, dude i have no idea where my grappling hook is i guess it's somewhere but we don't even need it dude uh, let's actually go over here to uh should i say the deep caverns yeah i think we should go to deep caverns um this is actually where we can test it out and see how much damage this sword actually does i think i may go for the spicy reforge as well because i heard that's that really good but right now i think legendary will do until i can get some more money to change the reforge but yeah also i heard that talismans are super good because if you guys don't know you can reforge talismans and increase your crit damage so that's super cool uh, we're gonna go over here let's actually uh I didn't, I didn't even see how much damage i did there but um let's actually run around here let's look for a mob which we can hit we have one zombie over here let's see guys 1.5k okay it didn't crit it didn't crit right there so we're getting like 4k crit right now guys uh that's honestly pretty sick um i think we can get more guys i think we can get more uh, we got like 1.5, 4k, 4k, uh, let's see what we get here, another 4k, is the highest 4k, I keep getting 4k dude, what is this, oh wow, I keep getting 4k Chris dude, 
I got 5k over there, 5.7k. 4k, dude. Oh my god. This is honestly insane. Dude. Dude, look at my sword. Look at the sword. Dude. Dude, I got you. I got you, bro. Okay, he's just gonna keep mining. But yo, dude. I'm so hyped, bro. I remember when I did like no damage to mobs and now I'm doing like insane damage. Also, what I want to do is test out this ability. So. Uh, let's get a bunch of these mobs together and then let's actually right click let's see what this does oh he actually killed two of them and i got a achievement as well kill a mob using oh my god i'm gonna die <laughs> i'm gonna die because my set doesn't even have any pro on it but yo dude this is insane bro i'm so happy to have a sword like this i am gonna go over here to the bank and actually um get some money so I can reforge my sword and get spicy. So uh, yeah, I'm literally going to take everything out, dude. I'm taking everything out. There we go. I have 79k. And hopefully I can actually reforge the sword to have spicy. Because I feel like I'm not getting too many crits because I do have legendary on the sword. I think going for spicy would be the best thing for me. So uh, let's actually put this in the... Wait there we go dude okay it wasn't going in there for some reason all right we got strong keen spicy oh that's what we're talking about let's go guys okay so i actually want to see what you get with spicy that's what i'm really curious about um so let's look on the sword as you can see with spicy we get plus 32 percent crit damage so that's honestly pretty cool. I think I should be doing a lot more damage now. Because before I wasn't really doing too much. Alrighty guys. So we are currently here at the Blazing Fortress. And as you guys can see. I am doing like 5.7k to these magmas. So that's actually pretty awesome. What do you guys think about the Leaping Sword? Let me know what you think about it down below. Do you think it's worth 3 million dollars? Uh, leave your comments down below. I will be replying to all of them and also let me know if I should maybe grind for divers for the next video because I'm thinking maybe I can actually do a full comparison to see whether if emerald is better than diver or if diver is better than emerald so we can truly see what set is superior i think that would be a really awesome video but yeah guys hopefully you did all enjoy this video if you did make sure to leave a like subscribe to the channel hopefully you do all have a wonderful day and i'll see you all in the next video peace Roll, roll, roll to the ships, even though I shouldn't. AMDA next up, new wave, new pace. Man, I'm pushing the pudding. Flip that, hold the feds ain't looking. Jump in a lab with a beat, then build up a spliff, then get to the cook.